A professional organist at Santa Fe St. Francis Cathedral is on leave tonight. He is the subject of a child porn investigation. Good evening. State police investigators served a search warrant at the home of Patrick Railsback yesterday. The Archdiocese of Santa Fe tells News 13 that Railsback has been relieved of all ministerial responsibilities at the St. Francis Cathedral. He is also on administrative leave, and News 13's Tim Maestas is live with more in the Newsplex. Diane Railsback is the subject of a child porn investigation that began back in October. At Santa Fe St. Francis Cathedral, 56-year-old Patrick Railsback is the associate director of music. A CD featuring some of his musical work is for sale on the internet. Railsback plays the organ. We tried calling him today for answers. According to state police investigators in this search warrant affidavit, an image of three juvenile males naked inside a shower room was linked to Railsback's computer late last year. Investigators seized a number of computers, DVDs, thumb drives, and Palm Pilots after serving a search warrant at his Santa Fe home yesterday. The investigation is ongoing. Railsback has not been arrested, and he has not been charged with anything. Hello? Hi, can I speak to Patrick Railsback, please? This is Tim Maestas from Channel 13. Railsback answered the phone today, but he did not want to comment on the investigation. In a statement released this afternoon, the Archdiocese of Santa Fe said the Archdiocese and the Cathedral Basilica staff had no prior knowledge of any inappropriate behavior toward anyone during his five years of employment. The Archdiocese says Railsback had no access to computers at the church. Once again, Railsback has not been charged. Archdiocese officials say they will continue to fully cooperate with investigators. Diane, back to you. Thank you, Tim. The investigation began as the result of a tip from the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children, which was notified of the suspicious email by America Online. State police would not comment on the case because the investigation is still